I saw him earlier. He's in town. This could be the solution to our problems. How? So um, this film is an uh, action thriller with uh, very family-oriented characters. Both Carol Aquino and uh, Takehiro Hira, uh, they play a very family-oriented guys. They want to do something, they want to fix their problems in the family. And because of that, they get into this like journey to catch me who's a villain that has a you know, 10 million uh, Japanese yen bounty. I'm a serial killer and then they try to uh, catch me. So that's the basics of it. Behind it, of course, it, it has great action scenes, but also there's like so much drama to it that you get to see Carlo's different kind of face from his, you know, previous works. He does like serious acting with like, you know, a lot of action. So I think he was very excited about it too. My character, uh, Tatsuya Aso, he doesn't speak so much in the, in the movie. His presence is always there, but maybe as an audience, you wouldn't get so much of his background or what happened to him. So I had a lot of free time and freedom to, to create this character, but he is one of the worst person I've ever played, right? So like how to, how to find that clues in him to, to, to create this person? He definitely had several incidents, of, you know, stories that made him who he is. He is very straightforward, uh, maybe a Japanese-like man, very diligent, very, you know, square. And that kind of clicked and went to the other way, complete opposite way. And then he got to this, like, really dark side of uh, life. Having international cast and the international crew members, the staff, was, it's very, you know, sometimes it does take time because our work ethics and our work patterns are different. So we have to kind of talk about it, how you guys do this, do that. And uh, especially we wanted to go for uh, international standard, like Hollywood standard. When I read that, uh, script. Um, it had a lot of elements to it. The family, the action, and also this like a little bit of OFW kind of, you know, like Filipino guy coming to Japan trying to find his opportunities in different country. Mm -hmm. And I was in the US and Germany too, so I could relate to that. It's not always easy to make a way in to a different place too. One of the um, scenes that I was fighting against Carlo, he was trying to, you know, punch me, but he, his thumb got stuck in the jacket pocket and he di dislocated his thumb, but he kept on going and then it cut and he's like, ah, and then like, what happened? He's like, my thumb, but we look at it and it was like swollen. It's like, oh my God, we have to go take you to the hospital or clinic. He's like, no, we can do it. But like, we're like, no, 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 no we have to take care of you. So we, he, we took him to the clinic and then he actually did the whole scenes that he had to do in that day. So of course that action scene, I, I really love it. I love the choreography too, but that, you know, Carlos' passion, I think is in there too. Um, we did have a screening at the, at the Mint College. Can I say that? I yeah, at the college and uh, the students uh, really, really enjoyed it. And then uh, a lot of people came up to me and like, I had after talk too, like, you know, and uh, people were asking questions and they're like, you are so different. <laughs> you know, from that. It was so touching that, you know, they kind of told me that they really loved my character, even though he's like a horrible person too, but uh, people could relate to me. Yamiki Ushijima kun, uh, Lone Shark Ushijima, I think in English. Uh, the main, like, he's a great actor. He's like this lone, lone shark. He's a bad guy, like, you know, but he's very attractive. 
And also there's one character played by Takashi Mary Jun. She's half Filipino, half Japanese. And she has a great character in it too. And she's very scary female kind of bad lady, but very attractive and charming. Oh my god, but I, I always play, like not always, but mostly play villain. <laughs> <laughs> it would be maybe a s a b r o He's like a kind of Japanese samurai er era thief. He's a thief, so like maybe they can tag up and do like horrible things together. Like <laughs> October 16th, uh, nationwide uh, cross point will be in the theater. Uh, so uh, please come and watch and enjoy the film with us. Thank you. Para sa iba pang content, ifollow lamang ang social media pages ng News 5.